And we're in. Wow. Here it is. Eligard's Redstone Laboratory. Seems more like an entrance or a foyer or something. I'm gonna say, somehow I don't think this is a main lab. I just hope she can actually help us. So what do we have here? Ooh. Fancy. Satisfying. Switch on this one as well, maybe it'll do something. And these are pressure plates. Bit of a weird opening mechanism for the greatest redstoner the world has ever known, but... I'll go with it. Oh yeah, this is definitely more main lab. It's as messy as you would expect. Look at those pipes, they're color coded. Might be the most redstone stuff I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> you can say that again. Come on, keep moving. Oh, bloody hell. What are those things even for? Maybe, I don't know, breaking things up, keeping intruders out. There are lots of possibilities. Aha, redstone repeater. We can, um, can set the delay. Okay, almost. Definitely a step in the right direction. Why don't we just break it? Oh, God gonna have to be a time thing. Waha! There we go. Nicely done, Jesse. You're pretty good at this. Hey, what can I say? Me and the redstone just speak to each other. Uh-huh. Yeah, sure. She's moving a lot of different ingredients around here. Man, look at all this, huh? Whatever she's working on, if it requires all of these ingredients. Yeah, don't touch try anything. Not to touch anything? So we know what it does, okay? I wasn't gonna touch anything. I was just going to look really carefully. Don't touch Come anything. Ah, oh, lava curtain. See, this is basically what the the bovine lava disco was. Just a lava curtain. Elagoda could probably make this in her sleep. She's not gonna think it's that impressive. A mech, on the other hand. Pretty nice. Okay, we all know that lava does not go down that quickly. Takes fucking years. An elevator by the looks of it. This close to meeting Eligard. Getting excited? <laughs> like you wouldn't believe. I wonder what she'll really be like in person. I, I was gonna say, we have got no idea of guessing. You know what they say? Never meet your heroes. Are those? That? Yeah. I wonder why she even has that circuit. <laughs> I wanna push it again. More bats. Huh. Maybe Elagard's secretly Batman. You never know. There we go. Oh, that was really satisfying, the way they opened one by one like that. Right, up we go. Nice, simple water elevator with shines. Made a few of these in my time. Here we are. Tell me we're actually here now. There she is! Oh, wow, she's even got, like... Request levers. This is just like I dreamt it. Entering Eligard's laboratory, seeing her right there. Don't get too creepy, she Olivia. To be her apprentice, and the next thing you know, we'll be changing the world together. Let's just try to save the world first. Yeah, there needs to be a world for you to save first. Check the system. Inventory request operational. Delivery latency speedy. Still talking to myself. Hey, all good inventors talk to themselves. All right, here we go. May as well talk to her. 
off with another test. Miss Elagard. Oh, hi. Hey, didn't see you sneaking up on me. Just got some it wasn't time. intentional, I promise. Don't touch anything in here, okay? It's all supremely fragile and genius. Okay. Did Calvin send you? You my new assistant? Um. New assistant with a stupid and adorable pig, that is. Ah. Uh. <laughs> She thinks we're her new assistant. It's an honor to meet you. No time for specifics, I'm afraid. Hey, you, Goggle Girl. Switch on that T-flop circuit to activate the delivery chute. And you, non-goggle guy? Grab me a blaze rod and an iron block. She wants me to do something for her. What if I screw it up? What Olivia, oh, breathe. Breathe. Oh, you must be joking me. Oh, now I need an assistant to help with my assistant. Think you can handle it on your own? She told you to press a button. <laughs> Olivia, she told you to press a button. How are we going to save the world if you faint after Elagard? Oh, my lord. Oh, Olivia. You okay? Olivia. Uh, Olivia, can you hear me? I don't think that I've ever fainted before. Oh, so embarrassing. Everything working over... Ooh. Hmm. Fine, I'll just do it myself then. Oh. Whoa. Come on, come on, come on. Just wait up, wait up, big. Oh. Loser. Uh, file number 6,000. 6,000? Now, about you three. Uh, your friend here. Does she fall over frequently? Is this going to be a regular occurrence? No, she was just I, really no, excited to meet I'm you. I'm sorry. I was just so excited to... And with me always pacing around, lost in my own um, thoughts. I could have tripped over Yeah, we've actually got brain. bigger no, problems. Gone. <laughs> Eligard, we've actually got much bigger problems to deal with. We're actually here to get your help. There's a giant wither storm and it's attacking the entire world. A wither what? What are you talking about? Who, who sent you? Uh, Calvin? Gabriel sent me. Calvin? Well, yeah, Ivor. Ivor is the one that did this. You know about Ivor? He's created a terrible monster. Look, you both seem like very pleasant people who are prone to fainting, but I simply don't have the brain power for this. The world is ending! My greatest project to date. A powerful block capable of altering reality itself. Yeah, the command block. We know about that. They're trouble. Probably seems like a great idea, but you really don't want to do that. Wait, 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 wait. How do you know what a command block is? It's not to seem belittling, but we are talking about... Um, mega Ivor had one. He used it to create the Witherstorm. I've seen one up close before. It was Ivor's. He's done something terrible with it. The world needs the Order of the Stone. That's why we're here. Exactly. Ugh, sorry to bust your circuits, but the Order isn't really together anymore. We, uh... Sort of yeah, we kind of gathered that. Ha ha! Gabriel gave it to me, and he's probably out there. Come on, Elgard. This is serious indeed. All the more reason why I need to finish my command block. I can use it to fight this witherstorm monster thing, or. Whatever. Necessity is the originator of invention. And that monster is my necessity for inventing. Of which I am the originator. Okay, is that possible? Even possible? Can you really do that? This is the Eligard you're talking to. Fair. Who is me? If you're confused. Uh, yeah. And yeah. Eligard will make a command block today. Your Witherstorm problem was created by a command block, yes? A command block could be the perfect way of beating it. And maybe you help me make one. It's going to work this time. I can feel it. Well, I did say in the previous episode that we did need a super weapon. Fuck it! Let's make a command block! Let's get started. Fantastic. Here we go. Got the ingredients. Make a command block. Huzzah! Payow! Skadoosh! There we go. I love that she's got request levers. That's so cool. 
Redstone, Lapis, and Emerald. It seems as though we put... It's the combination of... 9, 18, 27, 36 different ingredients because putting them all, filling out each crafting table, and there's four crafting tables. Go, Ruben! Huzzah! And yeah, we combine them, and the combined ingredients are going to make a command block. And we need the right specific combination. Need more ingredients! More ingredients! Grab them all! Place them all! Come on! Hit that lever! Hey! Come on! Ah, oh, another failed attempt. Come on! We can do this! More ingredients! More placing! Another flick of the lever. One more time. Ayow! Oh. Oh. Excellent. Good. This is so exciting. Oh. Has it gotten this far before? No, never. Come on. Is it destabilizing? Um. With a storm! It's here! Oh, bollocks. And right, oh, fucking grab her. Come on. Right when we were about to make it as well. That could have been the attempt. Really terrible timing. Yeah, no shit. No, no, don't apologize now. We, we just need to go. We need to get out of here. Get the fuck out of Dodge. Oh my god, it's tearing everything apart. Oh, beautiful redstone here. Oh god. Jump! We'll make an action hero yet, Jesse. Oh my god, it's gotten quite large. Oh god, it's tearing everything apart. Go. Go. Ah! No! Get off me! Let go of me, fucker! Let go! Get off! Oh god. Oh no, it's gonna tear up the bridge. It's gonna tear up the bridge. Oh no. Uh, jump, Jesse! Uh oh. We gotta jump! Get up, Jesse! Come on! Get up there! Oh, it's gotten very big. It's much bigger than before. Go through the portal. Oh. Well, that didn't go well. Oh, wow, we made it back already. We should have creeped on that hill there. Oh. Okay, just a little farther. It's like very shoddy modifications. Certainly impressive. Wow. Pretty shoddy if you ask me. Lucas. Oh, there's the creeper. Ooh, nice shot. Lucas! How's it going? Uh yeah. Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice! In fairness, it was. I'm so glad you're back. It was like wide open before. And we brought Eligard. Yeah. Fantastic. Quick, come on! You guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone. Wait, who? Gabriel. Gabriel. You're okay. Hello, everyone. It is good to see you. He showed up not too long before you guys. Eligard, my old friend. Boy, are you a sight for sore eyes. Maybe with you here, we actually stand a chance against this thing. Oh, how I've missed your optimistic spirit. Oh, and it's especially good to see you, Jesse. Good to see you too, pal. I fear that you might be the last face I ever saw. I'm glad you're okay. Getting here was hard. It's such a relief to see you. I'm glad you're okay. If you hadn't pulled me out of the Witherstorm's clutches, well, 
Let's just not think about that. I what? came here to the temple, hoping against hope to find other survivors. It makes me glad that even in these terrible times, where's this Petra? Can stand as a stronghold, a symbol. Wow, did Petra get away too? Did you see? That creature left in its wake was bedrock. I barely got away. It needs to be stopped. And we're gonna be the ones to stop it. We are alive. That means there's still hope. Come along. Everyone else is still inside. Slowly bringing the order back together. Boy, can't remember the last time I saw this place. Would someone care to explain what he is doing here? Magnus? Oh, this isn't going to go well. Right. I forgot to mention. Axel went on a little... adventure of his own while you were gone. Of course he did. To get him? Did you know about this? No, I told him to stay here. You did this on purpose. No, I didn't. Hey, Axel's my friend, okay? I didn't know he was going to get Magnus. You gotta believe me. Well, I hope you're not expecting me to work with that cretin. Look, just wait here a second while I figure out what's going on. Much appreciated. So much for bringing the order back together. Hello. So, who are you then? And why'd you bring the queen of the nerds with you? That's Jesse, my best friend. Trust me, Jesse's totally cool. Hi, uh, we're um, <laughs> we're reuniting the order. We are reuniting the order of the stone. I got tired of waiting around, so I decided to go recruit Magnus myself. I told you to stay I here. The adventure, but it all worked out in the end. And now I'm the king of Boomtown. What? Ah, we've been bonding and stuff. <laughs> I've had like the best day. What? Boomtown? That's the name of Magnus's kingdom. I had to beat him in a crazy tournament. And long story, you had to do it. Short version: epic battle of explosions and mayhem. Death-defying action, shenanigans, and pyrotechnics. Bada bing, bada boom. Cool. Your friend here is kind of supreme ruler of my kingdom now. You know what I mean? Well, this is unexpected. Oh dear. I'm not entirely sure what you mean, but I'm definitely sure that I don't like it. Guys. Yeah, show him some respect. Oh, you're sticking up for Magnus. That's very. Stop! Just all of you, stop! Oh, cut it out! Crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry wither storm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. It was terrifying. It came out of nowhere and just destroyed everything. A little too scary for you, Ellie? Couldn't just think it away? You weren't there, Magnus. Yeah, in fairness, you weren't there. Nothing I've ever seen. Why? Because oh my god, shut up! Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Yeah! Jesse speaks the truth. We must find a way to defeat that monstrosity. Thank you, Gabriel. Well, I don't know if you've had the chance to poke around this old dump yet, but it's pretty much stripped bare. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. So... What are we going to do? Getting along? So what are we going to do? How are we going to stop it? Well, let's not panic, first of all. That's a good first step. But against such an unthinkable enemy, even all the TNT in the world might not be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Soren. Ellie, not this again. Wait, Magnus. You may have a point. Soren did have certain objects, inventions. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not something bragging. stronger than TNT. I, I want to hear TNT. about that. There's something stronger than TNT. Soren had a kind of super TNT, stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formida bomb. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F bomb before. <laughs> F bomb. Yeah. I'm gonna drop Soren an F bomb in a minute. <laughs> Uh, how could that even exist? This thing sounds impossible. How could it even exist? Impossible objects 
where Soren's specialty. Oh. We don't know where Soren is, but we found Magnus and Eligar. Do you know where he is? Well, we could try using the amulet again. It didn't show him last time. But maybe this time. Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the nether. Or the end. But it's worth a shot. We've got to try. Well, he wasn't on the map last time. He wasn't on the map. I guess we've got to try. I want to talk to Gabriel. I can't believe he's here. Hey, Gabriel. Well, go on, Jesse. Show them what you can do. All right. No use to waiting around, I guess. Let's do it. Put it there. We've still got to flick the lever. Luckily, we don't have to do the whole uh, puzzle again this time. Just one single switch. Boom! We got three lights this time. Elagards, Magnus, and Gabriel's. Right, there's your light, my light. Gabriel's light. And Soren! That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. All we need to do is go there. He invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. I'm glad we can agree on that. Well then, you know, let's go. Never actually went there with him. Then let's stop hanging around here and go get us some super TNT. Uh-oh. That's in the middle. Whoa. It's a fifth light. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Uh-oh. Fifth member of the Order of the Stone. Blue? That's Ivor. Oh, bollocks. Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move. Oh, no. Not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Yeah. Righteous. We'll get some rest and head out first thing in the morning. Avoiding all the nighttime monsters. <laughs> <laughs> I like Magnus. If you had seen that monster, you wouldn't be saying that. We need to leave now. I think it's following us, Magnus. And I don't want to risk it catching up with us. We have to go now. I think we should wait till so morning. Bad. We've had a rough day. And I think everyone could use some rest. It's not night yet. We'll just go as fast as we can. I think Magnus might be right. And he's not usually a big fan of safety. Of course you'd pick his side. I don't want to risk being outside when it gets dark. We should wait till morning so we can have a full day of sunlight. Jesse here is talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that. You're just saying that because it's your plan, <laughs> but fine. And the God will remember that. I'm just trying to look out for the group. 